Fiery protests in Barcelona as austerity grips Spain. Pockets of violence were reported around the country. Flights were cancelled, trains halted and heavy industry slowed as members of two unions heeded the call for action. It was called after labour laws were relaxed by the government, making it easier for bosses to sack their staff and cut their wages. The Conservative cabinet, which took office in December and is led by Mariano Rajoy, is trying to liberalise the jobs market. The unions say the decree has now removed hard-fought protections for workers. This labour reform personally affects me because after all these years they're going to fire me with just 20 days compensation after 45 years working for them. It's come on the back of swinging cuts to services and tax hikes for Spain's wealthiest as the country tries to shrink its budget deficit. Today the new government will pile on more pain to try to achieve that goal, cutting departmental budgets by as much as 15% across the board. There's good reason for nervousness in the Eurozone. Unlike Greece and Portugal, Spain is deemed too big to bail. British banks are also heavily exposed to Spanish debt. With unemployment running at 50% among young Spaniards and with no monetary levers to pull, the government in Madrid says it has little choice but to wield the axe once again. Robert Nisbet, Sky News, Brussels.